Hi guys, I'm here with Jen from Watch Them Grow Photography. She is a newborn and lifestyle photographer and I'm gonna ask her a few questions about newborn photography today that can be really handy to know. So first off, Jen, welcome. Thank you. Thanks so much Thanks for, for being having here. Me. Yeah. Um, so what type of photography do you do? I do what's called lifestyle photography, which is very natural and I come to your home. So um, it's all very non-stressful and relaxed and you have everything at arm's length in your home um, to be able to care for your baby and um, from feeding to changing nappies to everything's there. Yeah. So, um, and you know, if you have a toddler, um, toddlers can come in for a few shots and then dad can take them outside yeah. so you work with both newborns and toddlers family yep all types of yep yeah uh, even maternity shoots right yeah pregnancy yeah. shoots yeah, yeah yeah no i i um i do maternity right up to teen and tween fine art. and how does a photo shoot normally work so what should i dress my baby in what should i wear and what kind of props do you use okay i don't really use props that's that's why my work is very natural so mums and family try and stick with neutral colors um, or plain colors so or pastels so your whites your blacks beiges grays um, denim looks great too um, for the dads because I know a lot of dads have denim shirts that they like to wear okay. um, and the mums just it can be just a plain neutral top or even lace looks beautiful in shots because mm. I, I try and do it softness in my style of photography so and and that's another thing when you're looking for a newborn photography make sure that you look at their uh, website to see their work because um, newborn photography varies greatly with mm. um, who you actually book. So it really comes back to what style, oh, style. Yeah. you like. Yeah, and if you have that rapport with the photographer. That's the beauty with you, isn't it? That you are a lifestyle photographer as well, and family yeah. photographer. So you can do the newborn within the 10 days, but you can also do it when it's a little bit older. That's right. Well. With the newborn, I usually undress them just to their nappy and then we swaddle them and then we wrap them in the blankets and and I've got in my suitcase full of tricks <laughs> I've got a whole heap of swaddles and things that you can choose from you know with the colors that you yeah. like all in those neutral tones yeah so and even dresses for the mums and even dresses yeah. for the mums that's yeah. amazing that's yeah. so good yeah. yeah. so how do I know when to book in an appointment so let's say I'm pregnant and I don't know mm -hmm. when I'm going to give birth but mm -hmm. I do want that newborn feel How um, do I... usually around the 20 week scan I, you know if you want a maternity as well um, I book in then and what I do is I book in your due date uh, not book in sorry pencil in your due date in my diary so and I leave room around that date okay. for and your shoot and, and then, then I just call you when that's right when once the once the baby's okay. born then we lock it all in what if baby is very unsettled and awake a lot of the time mm -hmm. how do we work around that the beauty of lifestyle photography is it doesn't matter if your baby is asleep or awake um, there's certain things that you do that I get you to do prior to me arriving at the house mm -hmm. so if you can feed the baby just beforehand um, hopefully they've had a bit of a nap but if they haven't that's fine too um, you know I I, I love working with babies I, I love soothing them and all of that and you know it, it's very difficult for new mums that you know in those first few weeks with hormones racing and lack of sleep and and everything's really hard um, but that's what I'm there to to do to help them with all of that and and do the photo shoot at the same time. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, we did have a photo shoot last week together yeah. and you did settle the baby and make it fall asleep. So she is really good. <laughs> <laughs> How long does a session usually take? Um, it varies. It really depends on Bob and also 
if there's a toddler, the toddler can mm. make the shoot go longer. Yeah. Um, so usually on average, for a newborn shoot, it's about two and a half, three hours. Okay. Um, you know, and I will stay there for as long as needed. Yeah. All right. And how long can I expect um, to get the photos. the photos after the shoot? Yeah. Well, I cull them. Um, which is really hard, but yeah, I do. I can um, and then I work on them individually and edit them in my style and get rid of any blotches or milk pimples or anything like okay, that. Okay, that's handy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The, the Photoshop comes in real handy. <laughs> yeah. and, and those grey circles under the eyes with the mums, don't worry, I can fix that up oh, too. Amazing. So, <laughs> yes, yes, Photoshop's really good. Um, yeah, so. Um, I can do all of that. So once I do all of that, I then load them to an online proofing gallery, which you then go through and select your photo. So just quickly, with because um, you do maternity shoots as mm -hmm. well, when is the best time to have those lovely bump photos? Yeah, probably from about 26 to about 35 weeks, somewhere in that time frame. You're showing that gorgeous bump, but... Um, you're not at that awful uncomfortable stage or you know huge you know yeah. the last couple of weeks because I know what I was like I was you know yeah ugh. <laughs> and the maternity shoots I think I think it's nice to have it done yeah. um, because you know you don't know if you'll be pregnant again mm. and it's nice to be able to look back at that time and even your child to look back at that time and go, oh, I was in mum's tummy then. Yeah. You know. If you guys have any more questions um, for Jen, go check her out on Watch Them Grow Photography on Instagram. I'll put the handle up here so you can go straight there. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed our chat. Thank you so much, Jen. Thanks for having me. Mm -hmm.